team once again at the end of the month. What needs to be the focus in order for you all to come out on top once again? The Clippers? Yes. Uh, I think we just need to um, do what we did today, you know, um, match their intensity, match their energy that they bring to the game, and just um, lock in on defense and guarding the ball individually because they're an ISO team, they're a team that like to attack mismatches. So uh, I think, you know, um, long as at the end of the month we stay focused on guarding the ball individually and just matching their energy and their effort, you know, we'll be all right. Now it just seems like during the game, especially during the second half, you guys put a little bit more of a complete effort offensively and defensively. Uh, would this be the type of effort you, you would like to see from the team just going forward? Oh, yeah, for sure. That's, that's the whole goal. You know, I think, uh, I think we've, you know, everybody's trying to come, come together. Everybody's trying to, you know, find themselves on the team and find where they fit in. At. And, uh, you know, everybody's, the question marks are kind of like leaving and, you know, everybody know what they need to do, know what, they, what coach is expecting us. So uh, I think now the effort is easy to bring. You know, the, the energy is easy to bring. It's hard to bring that effort energy when you don't know and you're still learning. So I think uh, now, you know, our effort and our energy will be more consistent. Now your other your newer teammates that you guys have had on the road and now c coming uh, back here at home, how do you feel that uh, they're coming around the corner? Uh, I think they fit well with what, with what we're trying to do and what, how we play. Um, Will does a great job of stretching the floor and bring a, another shooter to the team. Isaiah does a great job of pushing the pace and uh, getting guys their shots and uh, making sure you know the ball is shared throughout the team and um, and just being the head of the offense. You know he does a good job of leading us and uh, you know we just the rest of us just does a good job of just filling in and playing off of each other and you know we didn't got to learn each other and got to you know get used to each other. And tonight's win, it just uh, proved that you guys played a real shorthanded lead tonight because Boykins went down. Uh, how much does this uh, team win help you guys uh, playing shorthanded? Uh, I think the team win was big, not really uh, just because we were shorthanded, just for, for the confidence, you know, uh, trying to build momentum, finishing out the year, um, trying to build a winning streak, you know, uh, what's that, three games in a row now. So we're trying to just build off of the wins that we've gotten and just keep going. Whether we shorthanded or we fully healthy, uh, the goal is just keep building off of what what we're doing. After only scoring nine points in the first quarter, bro, first quarter, what went through the last three quarters of scoring 103 points? Uh, we missed eight free throws in the first quarter. You know, uh, what's that? 12 points. So in the first, we make we make those free throws. It's 21, 29, and we you're not even saying nothing about it. So you know, I think we were running good offense. Uh, we did, we was playing our style, you know, guys, we just got to make free throws. And I think once the game settled in and everybody locked in on on the game, you know, we just cruised into it. With a few days off before Saturday's game, can you talk about what you guys will be doing uh, to prepare for Saturday's game? Uh, I mean, well, you, we got tomorrow off. So, you know, tomorrow will be rest and treatment, uh, you know, trying to take care of, you know, any bruises and bangs that, that we have. You know, from the road trip and, uh, you know, coming in on, what's today, Wednesday? Tuesday. So come in Thursday and be ready to practice and, you know, just get better and, you know, try to build from tonight's game. And, you know, hopefully we can start off Saturday a little better than we started today.